if you trust him as your Lord and Savior. Let him fill you today with his joy. Let him fill you with his love. The world is shaking today. It's shaking at the foundations. You have to have a, a strong foundation to stand. Well, why not stand on the creator who made it all? Who says one day he's coming back to judge the living and dead. But today is the day when you have to be trusting in him and know his grace and his love today at the cross where he died for you and shed his blood to bring new life and new hope. Don't be a caterpillar today. Be a butterfly. God wants you to be a butterfly, to change from your old life, your old caterpillar life, and become a new person, a butterfly. Jesus wants to give you new spiritual life where you fly forward in life and live for him. That's what he wants for you today. He wants that joy and that peace for you today. That's why he died on that cross. He gave his life a ransom for many. He shed his blood for many. He gave his life for many. It was God's blood that he laid down for you. And it was the blood of Jesus. Oh, my friends, there's love for you. There's joy for you. There's hope for you. My friends, he wants to fill you today. Fill you to overflowing. Fill you with the joy. Fill you with the peace. Fill you with the hope. He wants to fill you afresh today with peace and joy. But you've got to cry out to him. You've got to say, Lord, I'm coming. Lord, I'm sorry. Lord, forgive me. Lord, I'm sorry for breaking your law. Lord, Lord I, I, I don't want to be a Bible basher, but Lord, I know I need you. Lord, forgive me. Lord, cleanse me. And you come to him and he won't kick you away. That woman who committed adultery, he said he forgave her. And he'll forgive you and he'll show mercy to you. And he'll forgive you and he'll, and he'll put his arms around you and he'll show you his love. And he'll say, come here, my child. I love you. Come here. I rescue you. I love you. I want you. I've got a plan for you. 